back to my channel, The Boy, Season 2, Episode 6. Let's quickly go over what happened last episode because we really want to get into it before the next episode this week comes out. Episode 7 comes out Friday. Friday. Yeah. So hopefully we can watch that a little bit sooner than these two episodes. But the big thing that is happening right now is A, Butcher is back in the game. He's going to make a plan to get Becca out. Don't know if that's going to happen this season. Stormfront, her whole storyline... She knows Starlight knows because Starlight straight up told her, mm -hmm. and she knows about Starlight. So they have beef on each other. Don't know if that's going to be brought to light. If anything's going to happen with that, if they're going to have a final showdown. Yeah. But and then we got the stuff with uh, with Maeve, which we got a lot of Maeve the last episode, which I really yeah. liked because she's an interesting character. Yeah. Uh, we got the stuff with her and the film studio trying to force. Uh, her relationship into the movie. Obviously, Maeve is proud of who she is, but she doesn't want that Not shit that to, proud, yeah, yeah. to be forced into the movie. She always wanted her shit to be private. Yeah, exactly. And then Homelander is just, like, torturing her, and he makes it seem like he's the good guy, and he yeah. didn't do anything wrong, and he wants her to be happy, but... You would think that he would care about her the most out of everybody mm -hmm. in the seven, Because I feel like, yeah, they've been around... I think they've been... The longest. The longest they've been right? the longest yeah. relationship. But you would think that he would care about her, but he doesn't care no. about... Anybody. No. So. The only thing we got, like, emotion-wise out of him was when he was crying after the protest. And yeah, and he wasn't even crying. He was he crying was for himself. Crying for crying himself. People, exactly. doesn't, yeah. people don't like him. Yeah. And now he went on five points, and, you know, it's like, this yeah. whole point system is just so weird. It's whack. And yeah. then he goes to Stormfront for validation, like, hey, look, yeah. I did yeah, it. I that too. took your advice. We got the little end scene with him in the Stormfront. Yeah, I don't want to... <laughs> Have that in my memory. So, yeah, so pretty much now, Homelander is wrapped around her finger. Yeah. And she, he said, probably do whatever she says. Yeah. And uh, I think obviously Stormfront uh, likes the shit, likes uh, Homelander's ideology. Yeah. Just being this evil Well, because he's like the symbol of, of what she is advocating for, mm -hmm. which is white supremacy. Yeah, he's got yeah. the blue eyes, the blonde hair. The he's American like, flag on his uh, cape. Yeah. All that stuff. And we even saw a little, I mean, he's almost like the symbol for people who just want to be racist and, and want an excuse. He's the symbol of that. Mm -hmm. You know, even we saw when they traveled down south, Starlight, yeah. M.M. and Huey. Yeah, when they found out Liberty, yeah. We saw the Confederate flag That's on true. that barn with his Oh, his yeah, you're cape. right, you're right. I forgot about so that. So clearly That's people, true. people use him as a symbol. That's a good Point. Yeah, it's a good point. Justifying that. And I then guess. we got uh, the Black Noir, a lot of stuff with him. Mm -hmm. uh, seeing, kind of, we kind of, I mean, it was, at least to me, it was kind of scary the way they portrayed Black him. Noir, just him, yeah. like, just creeping on the roof. Well, he's and supposed then, to be like that. He's like silent but deadly. Kind of like, yeah, it's kind of like the Batman of the group, kind of. But yeah. I mean, way more brutal than Batman because yeah. Black Noir kills. And then we got. I would, even, I would even argue that he's a little more like Daredevil, but. That's, yeah, yeah. He's kind of very stealthy. He's very, he's silent. Yeah. And um, he can see under that, though. Yeah, yeah, he definitely. And, I mean, he definitely uh, understands everything going on. I mean, he was, you know, listening to Butcher and everything and mm -hmm. knew to back off when Edgar told him, you know, to yeah, stop. and Edgar was listening and saw the entire yeah, thing. He was ready, that. he was on call. So Edgar is, is really invested. He knows what's going on. He's, like, the all-knowing. My question as of right now with Edgar is, obviously he knows about Stormfront. How could he not? Or if he doesn't, why? Why mm. doesn't he know? And two, if he does know, why? Like, why isn't he doing anything about it? And why would he be an acceptable uh, person to advocate for that? Yeah, so he either, uh, I feel like he'd be, he either doesn't care, he either likes that ideology and wants to support it, yeah. or there's somebody behind him, like behind the throne, that he just that's pulling to the strings to. and he has to listen to. Maybe there's a higher up. Because, yeah. you know, obviously, you know... Maybe Stormfront's running everything, and she's the one making Edgar. Maybe. Do. Yeah, maybe. So, you know, who knows who's behind the throne. Hopefully we get a little more information about the sage growth. Well, that's what it's, I mean... That's what the description, that's what the description says. says. We didn't watch so, it. So it, really it is a mental hospital, which is what I thought. I just, I don't know why she's specifically calling with that dude there. Maybe it's She has a bunch of emails about it that Starlight saw, so maybe Starlight will investigate a little. Could be maybe a family I, member of her, maybe? Maybe. Or somebody that she knows? Maybe. I don't know. Brother or something? I don't know. Seems like this episode might focus on that. Yeah. So. And then also the stuff with uh, Letty, too. The Letty, right. The Letty Butcher, stuff the Butcher's canary. brother. We don't know what happened with him. Yeah. But obviously... Huey is like a Lenny 2.0 for some reason. Pretty much, yeah. And maybe Lenny died when they were like really young. And we didn't get to and we didn't get to hear Judy say why he died. Right. Like you said, it could be connected to Vaught. It could be something that was just so traumatizing to Billy that that, that just made him snap. Yeah. You know? And he so, already we already saw that 
Butcher growing up was not the most yeah. pleasant of children, yeah. so even without that Lenny trauma, so he was still an asshole. The Lenny trauma and then thinking that Becca was raped and then killed. And killed. Yeah, it's a, there's a reason why he's the way he is, you know? Yeah, so. like, he's a piece of shit, don't get us wrong, but... He he has reasons. Yeah. Yeah, he's a piece of shit, but he's a lovable piece of shit. I mean, for the past eight years or whatever it was, he was going based off a security cam video. True, that's true, but he's the piece of shit that I would be be okay hanging out with. Homelander's a piece of shit that I'd be scared to hang out with. Well, because Homelander's also a sociopath who has no emotions and doesn't care. Like Butcher I can have a drink with, but Homelander I'd be... I'd be afraid of, yeah, because yeah, it wouldn't be genuine conversation. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So, So yeah, I guess we're going to get right into the episode. So, without further ado, let's get into episode six. Nick Holland Girls, 3 a.m. to 5 a.m. Good job. So, you're Betty White. Oh, what a fucking question. Of course, I'm Betty White. Who wants to rob a bag? Damn. Fuck you. <laughs> Yeah, they're gonna know that they destroyed it, that she destroyed it. Or they just keep it in a certain area, or they just attach it to someone else. I guess, and think that she's still moving around. They could put it on a pot employee and it would be the same thing. You go to sure, work, sure. you go home. It's like you can't even do, do your, your job, job anymore. <laughs> That's fine. <funny. laughs> just take me in, just take me in, please. Kill me! Oh, oh my god, just kill the man, man. Get it over with. Sick freaks. Wait, but what kind of breakthrough? She came in before I could see anymore. Well, we better have us a little deco with this little bit of Let's be going to the mental institution. The Stop. sage group. Would yeah. you be amenable to joining us? Never. Going to shark and face the waters without shark. Also, just having a soup there would make me yeah. feel a little better if shit went sideways. So Butcher obviously hasn't really warmed up to her no. being part of the boys yet. You would think they would try to change their uh, their what? look up a little bit if they're wanted. Like shave or something. Wow. If anybody recognizes your face in there, I think. Your face is <laughs> too. Yeah, they kind of. He would probably have the best uh, chance because he's so generic. But Butcher, are you they're, kidding? Yeah, they're kind of all fugitives. Don't get cool. Oh, I don't think Butcher's going in. I never did. Oh. Just Frenchie and Emma. I think, yeah. I love when Butcher does that thing with like, <laughs> I can't really describe it, but... Oh, so this seems like a very, uh, Frenchy... Frenchy's what a Frenchy episode. Standard. You're looking at 20 to 25 minutes. Mm-hmm. She probably ends up recruiting him to get rid of his sentence. Yeah. I could use someone with your imagination. They go free. So he's kind of forced into joining on you. the boys. Right now. I thought he had a reason. Yeah. yeah. It's not like that's out of his playing field here. He was already doing some criminal shit. Here. Seriously? What is your problem with me? You know that I hate thought as much as you do. You know that. You're just a bigot and a bully. I know another guy just like that. He's got a flag for a cape. Stop. Uh Uh-oh. From that yeah. noise. That's storm oh, front. I guess go and go and check on that guy. Can we cool him now? Brother, if anything happens to them. She's gonna I notice Kimiko. She's gonna recognize her. She's gonna recognize her. They should have put they should have put her in the bed. Lot is making more soup terrorists. No. Oh, fuck no. These could just be the ones that they couldn't control. Yeah, damn. They just threw them all in. Oh, here. Just so so no. <laughs> what happened? Did you see that? No. Oh. Bro. <laughs> I mean, how was that a, uh, a super yeah. bad word? <laughs> Why did you have to be locked up for that? <laughs> the lamplighter. <gasps> so he is a soup. The lamplighter used to be in the center, right? Mm. So he's an employee there. Yeah. Why? I don't know. Obviously, he's working at Stormfront. Yeah. You think they'll recognize him? Nah, I don't think so. Or maybe I don't know. Oh Ooh. shit! That was dumb. Oh, that no. was dumb. Frenchy, what the oh, fuck? No. <gasps> no fucking way. 
you know, with somebody out there. They're gonna let all them loose. I wonder who this is. Is this sausage? Oh, I thought it was the sausage man. Hey, this is Cindy. Yeah, oh, alright. So what, she just focus and just... It's like fucking, uh, Magneto. Oh. Oh, she's letting them all out. What? How are they supposed to... This is literally like explanation. Yeah, I don't know how Vaughn's gonna handle that though. They all escaped. God, that's some scary shit. Look at that. What? What? That thing. Oh, that was the sausage? <laughs> <laughs> There's no. No! I think it's like acid or something. Yeah. Oh. Ew, ew. You're gonna burn yourself. That's so disgusting. Dude, I hate that. I hate throw up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he doesn't come. For what? For what? Huey. Oh, For what though? Oh. <gasps> Huey, Huey, Huey. Oh. <gasps> this episode is uh, it's getting crazy. Uh, we gotta get him to a doctor. Uh, you can't go. He's a fugitive. I'm sitting here and watching fucking will play that. Okay, okay, okay. okay. I've seen that documentary about you guys. It's not my type of shit. For a man in seven-figure debt, a heart condition, and in heavy withdrawal, do you really think you have the luxury to get up and leave? Damn. They're gonna give Shockwave your uniform, you know that? Call him the next day, train. No, they can't do that. Why not? A train is a trademark. You are just another nobody from the south side of Chicago. Man, fuck you, man. I can help. That brings up a good point. Can somebody else can become the next you? Homelander? No. But first, is it just... I think they're just saying that to, saying to that try that to lure him in. Yeah. That'd be interesting if it was the case. The because Starlight, who plays Lamplighter, she didn't become yeah, Lamplighter. That's true, that's true. Even though they do have similar powers. Him and Shockwave or whatever. I remember you, you know. You were telling me the night that I torched those kids. Maybe you'd like watching people burn, too. She's dead. I don't want to hear no bullshit about I'm going to get tired of the pussy. I love this girl. This is the one. Put sure with the slick back here. That's my plan. Oh shit. So what, was he a part of the boys? <laughs> You're gonna tell us every single okay, thing yeah, I you see and hear at the tower. Okay. It's a soup that they Especially planted inside the body. I look forward to your call. And so that's maybe... because he killed her grandkids and, and so basically she said, we won't ruin you if... If you help us out, they struck a deal. Because he, I at the end no, of the day, no, 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 she kill, he I, still killed her grandkids. I think, I, there's no way she would let him be part of There's no way she would let him do this after killing his grandchildren. Her grandchildren, right? Yes. I don't think she would want to look at the guy. Hold on. Don't let him out of your sight. Unless he killed her grandparents because he was ordered to. He was ordered to do it to prove his loyalty to Vaughn. Maybe. And then, then there was a falling out. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. know. I'm sure the comics explain all this too. Hey, but... trouble, Buddy, just put the gun down. I said, stay back. I said, put it down. Oh. Oh, yeah, baby. He died. I think so. He's bleeding from the head. Figured you boast about it to Homelander. Must have been thrilling for you. I'm not a fucking animal. Oh, only a fucking animal. You watch them burn alive, crying for their mama. If that's not an animal, then what is, huh? I didn't know. I didn't know that it was be that bad. You were supposed to be your boss. I saw you following me that night, and then you disappeared. Why didn't you stop me? Good question. It's an interesting, yeah, interesting backstory here. I want to see the actual instance. Like, I want to see it happen. So he was sent, I think he was sent by Vaughn to kill Mallory. Mallory. Because Mallory. But to prove that he was for real. Loyal, loyal, yeah. You know what I was thinking when I was looking at him? Why did you pull the gun? You stupid fuck. Maybe once I would have cried over him, but now he was just another person in our way. Damn. Boys mentality. That's not like her, yeah. Mm -mm. We're nothing alike. Nothing. No, they're not trying to make soups here. Vought 
is trying to stabilize it so that you put the V in any adult arm, anywhere, anytime, you get a solid soup. Wow. Solid peppers. They just make me burn the evidence. Yeah, but if Stormfront okay. is working on it, they're probably trying to make some some all white Nazi yeah, army of soups. Like that. that makes sense. Just like a just perfect yeah. like yeah. just perfect subjects. Uh oh. Is this sausage man? Stop. <laughs> It is. I think it is. <laughs> okay, that is a pretty scary That tower. is him, right? Yeah, it's gotta be sausage. Right? Look at oh. it. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. You know that set, right? That little that shit Probably. Out, right? All the fucked up <laughs> yeah. stuff in the show. You always have a sausage man. <laughs> That's crazy. That guy belongs in a cell the rest <laughs> of his life. He's your That's his fucking thing. <laughs> She wore from Lamplight. Oh, okay. She's probably... He's the inside. Yeah, yeah. Making the perfect subjects. She's got him doing that. I'm gonna go see if anyone else got lifts. What? Yes, I'll make sure find them. Oh, oh she's guy. just gonna. Maybe she'll just figure out. Oh, well, if she sees the black box, she'll know that they didn't do anything to stop it. The plane crash. Yeah. But that's not the black box, though. Oh, oh, Did you say sugarfish? Man, you gotta do a better job of hiding your shit. She, she sees that she. There's a daughter. Oh my god. That scene was so crazy in season one. I'm surprised that survived the crash. I'm gonna show that to Homelander. No. No. He's either gonna leave us alone. Or kill you. Yeah. Or I'm gonna put it on CNN. Or just kill you both. Yeah, I might, I might be like, yo, I, I can't do I'm this out. shit. I'm out. I know I should have stood up to him. I know that. Why are you looking at me like that? She's in danger part of, regardless. Part of, the part of us gotta realize that Maeve really can't no. do shit. I know. Well stitch, but he was okay. And would you about to think penis around your neck? <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Yeah, yeah tell him my sausage man. <laughs> sausage man. You never ask to be sick. Uh -huh. He cannot absolve my uh, sins. No one can. I leave you alone. Oh, she wants to say something so bad. What? I thought she was gonna say something. She probably will. I feel like she'll say something before the season ends. Or before the show ends. She's gonna say something. I know I wasn't welcome at the funeral, so all these years I couldn't offer my condolences. Where is he? Madame, please. If I may. I have no choice. He won't help you. All you'd be doing is ending his torment. You cannot punish him as much as he punishes himself. What exactly are you proposing we do with him? Get it back into the seven? Again? <laughs> My daughter, Chloe, she died of Alzheimer's. Oh yeah, she has an age. She has an age, but Homelander doesn't know that. I was born in 1918, in Berlin. Oh! What the fuck? Heinrich Himmler. Yeah, she's a straight up Nazi. She's a lovely dancer. And that's Goebbels. And... Yep. Yo, she was a straight up Nazi. That explains it. She's not even denying it. Richard Vaught. Wait, she got married to Vaught? He gave me the first successful V injection. What? Damn. She's like the prototype. No, yeah, she's just a straight up Nazi. Wow. We are in a war for the culture. The other races are grinding us down and taking what is rightfully ours, but we can fight back with an army of supermen, yeah, millions strong. Holy oh, shit. So she wants like, a, like World War III. Destiny. The fucking and you uh, will be the man who will lead us. The Nazis She's coming talking back. about mass genocide. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we found each other. And now neither of us has to be alone ever again. And that is the truth. Yeah, but she's actually kind of vulnerable there. Man, I didn't, I didn't 
I think he'd be down. I, I had a little hope for a home lander. Nah, he loves himself too much. But, but He's like, head of the army? army? I'm the face of it? Hell yeah. yeah. Alright. Look, that? that was probably the most packed yeah, episode packed in episode. terms of information. We got so much. That we got. So where should we start? Let's start with, let's work our way backwards. So it's Stormfront and Homelander. Okay. So she obviously likes him and is taking a liking to him because he could be the image. He's already the image of American pride and all the Americans love him. I mean, he's exactly what Adolf wanted. Would have wanted. Yeah. He, he likes the blue eyes the and the blonde, blonde, hair. blonde hair. So that's exactly what she is proposing. Okay, like so, the she, head of it. so she was a Nazi from the beginning. Like, she was always... Right, she the, was in the OG days, but then the founder of Vought used her as, like, the prototype oh, to experiment, and I guess... First successful uh, Compound V was her. Yeah. So she wasn't born with it. She was she was the first successful adult mm -hmm. to be injected with it, which is what she wants to do so to adults now. Maybe she stopped aging after she was injected. So she aged when she was younger. Right, because in that photo it looked like she was That uh, looked like the age she was. Right. So she so that that's probably part of the power. She stops aging. She stopped so it's probably aging. the moment she got injected. She, got, she injected. got injected. So maybe that's the case for all the um, adults that get injected when they're, oh my god, we are white as hell. Stormfront would love us. <laughs> <laughs> she, what she wants to do is start a whole army, which literally is what I said. Yeah, with the stuff with, I figured uh, that's what she wanted because facility. she, I thought it was just mentally ill people that they were trying to use Compound V to maybe make them sane again, but no, no but Stormfront involved. Well, she that's wanted. why they killed, uh, why they killed the one guy. Because so, he wasn't perfect. She wants him to be just, like, right, perfect. Right, right. But where does Lamplighter f run into this? Like, let's try to go through the timeline of Lamplighter. Oh, man. What I, after this episode, what I interpreted it as was he was an insider with the boys yeah. first. Yeah, yeah. Working with Mallory and yeah. everything, because she pulled a gun on him in the end. And yeah. the scene that we saw the flashback, she would have pulled a gun on so him I think had the timeline, that happened Yeah, before. so the timeline is uh, he went into Vaught. As was planted in there, like as, as their little spy, little double spy. agent. Uh, and then he was forced. The mission, well, the mission that he was told was go to kill Mallory because because they found out that they found, they probably realized okay she's trying to take us down let's kill right. her. So the mission was go kill her, which he probably didn't want to do right. Because no, but he, he has working. to. But okay, he but I'm, has I'm to. just saying his whole motivation. He probably wouldn't have wanted to do that. No, no, no. no we I don't are think so. so white right now. What is <laughs> happening? <laughs> He goes to kill Mallory. It ends up being in the bed the with actually his grandchildren. He burns the grandchildren, only realizing it too far into it. It was too late. It was too yeah. It was too yeah. It was too late. He killed them. Then what happened with him leaving Vaught and him being replaced by Starlight? They explained in season one. Did they why find out? The, they, they, I remember like, it was like the first or second episode. They explained why they he did left the boys. It. I think so. If anyone wants to remind us, yeah, I forget. Sorry. What? I'm sorry. It Why? keeps on. It keeps getting <laughs> fucked up. It's like overexposed and underexposed. I'm really sorry. We keep changing color here. That's all right. But um, uh, yeah, they okay. might have explained it in season one, but I genuinely forgot because yeah. he was replaced in episode one because that was Starlight's hole. She Starlight's came in and she filled his shoes basically. Okay, so yeah. So he kills the gra the grandchildren. Right. So what what is Frenchie's whole role? He could have stopped it, but he didn't. He could have stopped it, but it's like, so did Mallory know that he could have stopped it, and that's why she didn't want to see him either. Yeah, that's okay, why so she that's was, why, that's so that's why, why she, she Yeah, okay. Of course. But he, he had other, you know, his friend was literally ODing. Yeah, yeah. And, but, and he went back to check okay, on him. Okay, and then, so then, so then the grand, the grandchildren died. Right. And then the that's boys. That's why Mallory's and, not, I thought that's why she started the boys, though. So what was her no, whole motivation? No. I don't know why, I, mean, I don't even know why she started it to begin with. I thought that was the whole no, thing. I no. thought she started it because her grandchildren died and then she recruited no, cause, everybody cause, else. No, because they got... Lamplighter in there, and the boys were already established before that happened. You're right. So I don't know. We saw the scene of her recruiting Frenchie. Too. Yeah, yeah. So, oh yeah, you're right. She that scene too. She recruited Frenchie before. Yeah, so all I don't that. know the timeline. I don't, I don't even know, know if they ever mentioned why this, why the boys why were started. started it. Maybe we still don't know yet. I genuinely thought it was because of her grandchildren, but I guess not. So that's a question that I would like to be elaborated. Mm. I don't know if we're just dumb, or we just. Again. Yeah, it's fine. Okay it's fine. <laughs> we're just like. The sun keeps coming yeah. in and it's getting fucked up, so whatever. We're not part of that army that's that <laughs> still <laughs> hearts amazing, maybe. Don't worry, we're, we're not part of it. <laughs> um, but yeah, if any of you guys are aware, I, I genuinely don't remember because I haven't seen season one in a while. I don't remember what the whole story All was. All I know is I think they mentioned why Lamplighter left. 
And you think they said it? They explained it? Because I don't remember season... I don't know if they explained it. I, they did. They obviously mentioned that he was leaving, and that's why Starlight came. Maybe they, it was just they needed to cover it up? I, I mean, they, they presented it to the public as him just retiring. But I think maybe they found out that the grandchildren were killed. But and I don't think Vaughn would care, though. They would like it's the grandchildren of a woman they were trying to kill anyway. I don't maybe think they would Mallory, really care. Maybe Mal Mallory threatened them or something. Maybe, Except but we'll that's, that's nothing that Vaught hasn't had to deal with before. Yeah. Like they've right. covered more. They've covered worse. They've covered they covered the plane crash, which now is coming back into it. That's huge. We're, yeah, we gotta talk about that. that now. So we got the plane crash, which uh, they found instead of the black box, they got the video camera, Little which the deep found, which the deep and Maeve kind of have a thing going on now. And I think uh, they're exchanging information. Yeah. So if May, if Deep gives her information, then the, then Maeve can support him joining the boys. John, not the boys, joining the Seven again. Right. And then maybe he's already, to push he's already getting right somewhat of what he wants to do yeah. because he got to recruit A Train. So yeah, yeah. He wants I guess that was like the exchange. He's just like allowed back in, like on set. He's allowed back in to the boys, kind of. That's what Maeve is doing for him. Yeah, yeah. Pretty Give, much. Giving him that that spot, even though it's not an official spot. Uh -huh. now, he didn't officially retire though. Who? The Deep. No, no, he didn't. No, At he least was no, they, no. They just said he was like he just was sent away for or something. Yeah, he he's like on retirement. Yeah, after so but I guess now he's coming back. And then uh, A Train, they wanted him to join. And then that one guy at the church knew everything about A Train. Who? So we don't know. Remember that guy that that's, right. that uh, the head the, the head of meeting? the church of the club. So if he knew all that stuff about A Train, he might know some other stuff. He might have dirt on other people on, too. Because A Train was like, did you fucking tell him this uh, deep? And deep was like, I didn't no, see shit. Yeah. You know? So. That guy can know even He's more stuff. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, so we got that, and then we got that whole thing with the uh, with the prison breakout thing. The, the, that the, was crazy. crazy. That was some X Men. Yeah, shit. that was crazy. That and was then we crazy. got the Sausage Man. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to forget about the Sausage Man. <laughs> and then we got uh, yeah, the flashbacks were really interesting. And then we got the really nice moment in the hospital with. Uh, Frenchie and Kamiko? No, no, the... Uh, oh, oh, Frenchie Butch, and... Butcher and, uh, St and uh, Starlight. Oh, well, that too. Yeah, I like that. That was like a separate thing. That was really... Yeah, it was interesting seeing that go down whole, the whole episode, them kind of... Like, getting, bicker? Yeah, yeah. But Starlight made it a thing. She was like, even though I'm, I'm kind of with you guys and I'm adapting this... Uh, well, yeah, she this said mentality. she said she knew she had to get rid of that guy. Yeah, she said there was no other way. She's aware, but in no way she wanted to establish that. In no way she was she like Butcher. In no way did she yeah. allow her emotions to, to cloud her bread, judgment yeah. that much, uh -huh. which is something that Butcher very much lets yeah. happen. So I'm glad that they're bonding a little bit, and Huey's going to be okay. It sets back their timeline a little bit, but and the boys are also separated, but did so they, they have to reconvene and kind of trade information. Did you think because, Huey? Did you think that was it for a sec? Like, do you think he was yeah. Really? Yeah, I, 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 was like, I was like, well, when I saw it, I was like, shit. Was, but then I realized that this, uh, Starlight, she could quarterize yeah, it. Yeah, so, so. We got the Maeve stuff, the Deep. We the Ma talked the about Maeve that. stuff. Well, she, what? Maeve is planning to blackmail go Homelander. directly to Homelander, which I don't which think is, is a good idea. I think it's dumb because if he wanted to, he could kill her on the spot or just kill Elena. And yeah, there, what, there what's, stopping, what's stopping him from finding Elena? Yeah, and just killing her. I mean, like, Nothing. all right, Maeve. You That's know, why you I think she should go directly to. Which so is what, CNN or something. CNN, yeah, whatever something, yeah. news outlet she wants to go to because he cares so much about his image and his, you know, whatever, that if she does that, that's insane. I don't know yeah. if, I don't know if Edgar is going to like that that's shit, true though. Too. That's true, too. It's well, not even just Homelander. Yeah, it is that's a, Vought that's as an entire, because yeah. they that's covered that up. And after it happened, Homelander was like, we saved the day. Like, we tried to stop it from going down. The terrorists got that's the true. best of us. It's always been the terrorist narrative. So Maeve could really change the game if she goes public That's with that. That's true. Maybe Maeve will end up, uh, maybe Maeve and Starlight will end up working the, together. That'd be kind of cool. To take them down. Maybe everybody will team up together to stop Homelander and Stormfront because... Definitely not Black Noir. Black but, Noir is still down to fuck shit up. Yeah, but everybody yeah. has motivation. True, true. Uh, Black Noir is a separate entity, yeah. I feel. But A-Train, Starlight, Maeve, Deep... They all have motivation to want yeah, to take these fuckers down. Yeah, because right now it's Stormfront Homelander. It's just, Homelander's going to lead that army, I guess. Like yeah. you said, he's like the picture perfect. He wants to be the face. Anything that could allow him to be the face, the image of the good boy I mean, yeah, in you America. Brought up, you brought up the good thing with the Confederate flag with him, which I forgot about. People that use that point. to justify yeah. those beliefs. Yeah, that's a good point. And so the whole there, there will be people that are all for this superhero army. I and feel like that might be a big plot point yeah, in season the three. the fact that he said make... Uh, Let's make America safe instead of the world safe. Like that too, you know? So it's very focused on America, like, like white. Yeah. Okay, sorry, my camera died, or not died. It, the card got full, so we're just gonna <laughs> we're just gonna finish it on my photo booth. What were we talking about? The army. The army, yeah. So now uh, Homelander can lead the army 
with uh, with Stormfront, and then they haven't perfected this this um, serum that they're no, yeah, talking the compound about. Beat, they're still trying to get it to be perfect. Yeah. But well, yeah. Well, it was it was Stormfront that mentioned that. No, who was the one that mentioned that they wanted to be where as soon as you inject it, they're automatically a soup? Who said that? Was that Lamp? Lamp Lamp was saying it, that? but it was Stormfront's mission. It I turned, guess. Yeah, yeah, but but Lamp Letter mentioned how they wanted to get to that point. Right. That's why they're doing all the tests and everything. So Edgar has to know about this. He has to be very self aware. He's probably he, down for that. He knows everybody is. Yeah, but why would he be down no, for I, that? Well, I think Edgar. Well, I, maybe he's just maybe maybe he doesn't know about the whole Nazi thing. But I think if Stormfront told him like, hey, that's the whole mission. But Stormfront might have told him, hey, we're, we're working on something to where as soon as you inject it, we automatically get a suit and yeah. they're perfect. He might think. He it's might just, just for know like that. Mil- mil- yeah, he a might not know about army. the Nazi stuff. Who knows? I don't think he knows about the Nazi stuff at but all. He, but he also knows that it was founded by a Nazi. Vod. Yeah, and he even brought that up he to Homelander. So he made it a point to make that like he could be down a dialogue that he would... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know if Sausage Man's going to come back. I don't want Sausage <laughs> Man to come back. <laughs> No, I'm kidding. He's, He's locked up for that, a reason. That was my love when uh, when Fred was like, "Yo, tell exactly. him, to, <laughs> tell him, take uh, around yeah, and tell neck. him." To, he's like, "Tell Butcher that, tell him." <laughs> that was funny too. And that then was uh, funny. it was it was nice seeing uh, Frenchie's uh, backstory. Yeah, the backstory, and then Frenchie with Kamiko trying to be letting go of that yeah. attachment he had on her. Yeah. Obviously, he still cares deeply for her, and she cares for him. Yeah. she wanted she wants to speak so bad, and I yeah, think we're gonna get that by the end of the but season. The, but the fact that uh, he was like, "All right." Just do your thing. I'm not trying to hold you back. When you're ready, you know? like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So do it. That was good too. But great fucking episode. Yeah, it was a really good yeah. episode. Two episodes left. I don't think everything's gonna get resolved. No, no, they're gonna I leave. Like they're gonna leave something. The army thing is definitely gonna be season three. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. I think by the end of this season, we might get like a tease of it, just like actually it they working. They might show and like, yeah. I would love Storm. I don't like her, but I would love her to be Ooh, wait a sec. in season three. Homelander might want to get his son in on this. What do you have? I for, totally forgot about that yeah. whole story. He might, he might want to get his son So much needs to be wrapped up. That, like, two episodes is just not enough. I mean, enough. what's stopping Homelander from going to Becca, taking the little kid? Nothing. And then just inject, and then making him part of the army. Nothing. You know, who knows? Nothing. I don't know. That's well, once they perve- Once they perfect this serum, this compound V, it's I think the, Yeah, like you said, the army thing is probably going to be saved for season three. Yeah, And we also so. got to know if, if Edgar was, if he knows about this, we got to see what's going to happen with, uh... Now with Mallory and Lamplighter, yeah. what they're going to do with Lamplighter. You yeah. know, it's a lot of stuff that needs I don't think to be all resolved. Gonna be, it's not all going to be resolved, but I think uh, we'll, we'll get, we'll get some answers. Three. Yeah, we'll get some answers. Yeah. All right. Well, we got to go because we are currently about to go see Madagascar. Uh, why you, you got to tell them? Why? <laughs> As always, thank you guys for watching. Check out my other reactions if you have not already. And I will see you guys for episode seven. seven yeah. All right. Bye, guys.